So this move from bottom of side control is called the X guard on the arm into a triangle. So it looks like this. So from bottom of side control, I'm gonna to start to control my partner's arms. I give him a little bridge to knock him up and create a knee shield. My leg that is closest to the hip goes inside to create a little X. Now I'm going to control his arm. I usually like to get a little goose hook in here to make sure he can't cross face me and stop where I'm going. But I'm gonna extend my legs out and transition right into a triangle and finish just like normal. I'm gonna bring his arm across. I can even hook the leg. I can start to tighten up and then pull down his head to finish the triangle. So just like your normal uh, triangle finish here. But to give you easier steps to do this, I'm going to grab the wrist that is underneath, supposed to be underneath my shoulder. Now I'm going to bridge into him to create some space to bring the far knee into uh, his bicep. Now the knee that is closest to his hips are going to feed in and on top. That is the big part is that it has to be on top. This is the common mistake because when people start to push, if it isn't on top, you don't get the correct angle for your triangle here. So I bring his arm across. I can reposition if I need to, but you should technically be there and then you can feed into whatever you need to for your uh, triangle or even an arm bar if you are having trouble with triangles or your, your class is having trouble with triangles, you can easily transition it to an arm bar, a very basic arm bar.